Mission confirmed. Your ship is currently being delivered to the launch platform. So we're gonna start off with the Gemini. It's a Gemini kind of day. <coughs> Excuse me. Hey, what's going on, Toby? Welcome to the channel. Hey, Techno, how are you? You guys having a good day? Hey Tyler, what's up man? How's your, ti your channel coming along there Tyler? I hear you're doing pretty good bud. Right on. I'd say it's a good night for a little spin about the verse. <clears throat> Start off with my Gemini. I'm thinking of trading my Gemini in for a Caterpillar. I'm not sure yet, though. Caterpillars are pretty sweet. But the Gemini is a lot bigger. <clears throat> Gemini is huge. You know what, you probably do, believe it or not. Um, I don't think it would take a really beastly computer to run this, but the game isn't really... <clears throat> it's... how can I say it? It's... It, it's a... you know what I mean? It's it's pre-release. And it acts as such, right? So, like, I have a pretty decked out PC, but it just depends on the day, because, like, right now it's okay. But, 20 minutes it could be garbage, you know what I mean? You think I should keep the Gemini? That's kind of my gut feeling too, man. See, I think I'm kind of leaning towards... I think I'm with you. <laughs> I'm sure it would... <clears throat> I'm sure there's lots of stuff in uh, 3.0 of that when it comes out. It'll be per... You know what I mean? The Gemini will fit like... I'll be happy I kept it, I bet you. The Caterpillar seems like it's only good for, uh, like, storage. Like... Although it looks pretty sweet on the inside, I must say. Especially the pirate one looks good. I like the uh, constellations too. <clears throat> Oh, did it? That sucks. Yeah, you both tried it once you, uh... Are you getting, uh, are you getting a bigger hard drive, or...? I've had the Contour, the, uh, Constellation Taurus. Great shit, man. It's... 
Wow. I'm fine. <laughs> that was weird, eh? Yeah, that's right. I have a tower too. But no, my my wife has a really like, she has a really good laptop. Like this thing is a juggernaut, but I've always been a tower kind of person. Laptop for business or marketing or whatever and <clears throat> I don't understand how my Gemini just spontaneously combusted it. And I'm fine and dandy. That was hilarious. <laughs> so did you get your PC yet, Tyler? Good grief. Well, I suppose I didn't die. I shouldn't complain. It's a long fly, though, man. You do, yeah. And personally, I can't work. I don't work on laptops. I never really wanted to work on a laptop, but I could build a tower in no time, you know what I mean? So. Yeah. Plus, if you get a good tower and you have a good setup, it's not that hard to be mobile with it, but. But I, don't, I never take mine anywhere. <laughs> I have my uh, my PC monitor mounted mounted to the to the wall for the sakes. Hey, good day. What's going on, Henrik? What's shaking? I'm actually moving, believe it or not. <coughs> it wasn't I was planning on starting the stream and flo floating in space, but hey. I know, it's weird. I don't even know how many servers there are for this. Plus, I find right now, in, in its current condition, it's no it, it's no picnic playing with other people anyway, because you can't quantum leap with someone else in your ship, otherwise they'll start looping, you know? Like, it's just... It's almost pointless to play with anyone else at this point. Unless you don't want to sit around, like... Sit around like they do at Tim Hortons and just talk, I don't know. <laughs> That plane was just winging by, see that? We're there. We're home. <clears throat> I told a newbie that he could probably play for free, but he wasn't allowed having a ship, and you'd have to go from point A to point B just by floating around in space. Careful, careful. Oh, two. Come on. Bend the knees, bend the knees. There you go, buddy. Well done. <laughs> See, I like these. What a quinky dink. <laughs> I was going to. What a coincidence. Eh? As soon as I get underneath it, bang. It <coughs> turns on. You know what? I'm going to get in my car too and go catch him. I was gonna steal it too, that would've been funny. Jeez, I don't even remember 
come on this way before. Leggy. Okay, there we go. Okay, why am I getting emails all of a sudden? As soon as I start streaming, bang, all the emails are coming. Eleven thousand to respawn the Gemini right now. Eleven thousand bones, man. Yeah. I can get a set of armor for that. <clears throat> Look at that ship out there, yeah. It's getting a little bit laggy, actually. <laughs> Tis the way of the verse, young, my young Padawan. <laughs> the ones with the uh, with the helmet off. Oh man, what's up with that leg? This is <clears throat> my favorite ship, the Kirtuel. I know I was saying that the other day, man. That would be sweet. That's gonna be a game changer, man. VR and dual joystick. Oh. Oh yeah, baby. That's what's up. <clears throat> Hey, is that another one? It is. Check this out, guys. <clears throat> Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Yeah, I'd almost be scared to be stuck inside virtual reality, man, and... A good old Sarah Citizen bug happened and somehow your brain gets fried. What's up with the lag, man? Good grief. I have one joystick and it just it's cool but you need two joysticks right like you really do need two Man, I pick, <clears throat> and you know what? It's expensive too. Like, I wish I could get that set up, but I'm just not willing to dish out the money yet for VR. It's reasonable, but I don't know, man. But I know they have Fallout virtual reality. That would be sweet. Hey, Dragon, what's up, man? You kind of snuck in there like a ninja, eh? <laughs> I 
really appreciate you guys all being on my stream. I really appreciate the support, guys. I'm new and I'm trying to get big. I'm going to get big. It's just going to take some time. And but a great uh, community like you guys, man. I'm a lucky fella. Sirsers and fans are the bomb. Actually, you know what I do need? The lag fix. Can you do that in Cairo Astro Station? Can you fix the lag? Negative. <laughs> That'd be kind of a cool screenshot. <laughs> Hey guys, what's going? What's up? Thanks for being on the channel, man, guys. Like and subscribe. I'd love to have you subscribe. Join the community. We're a crazy happy bunch of SC fans. <laughs> I stream usually two or three times a day. I've been doing it for about a month now, guys. Give or take. Quite, quite new. Our cat's talking. <laughs> All right, <coughs> any mini money mo, which way are we gonna go? Hop in, man, buckle up. Grab a beer and sit and enjoy, absolutely. Thanks for subbing, I appreciate it. There's also a little notification you can click on too, so... Yes, I definitely can. I'll do some dogfighting action, but there's a little bell you can click too, so anytime... Yeah. Sorry, I'm kind of babbling here. But there's a bell you can click on, so anytime I do a, a Star Citizen stream, you'll be notified. So, poop for thought. Oh yeah, baby. Space technology, buddy. <laughs> Actually, I forgot this cost me 170. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do, Henrik. That's a good idea. We got Discord too, guys. If you want to uh, chat our citizen with the boys and the gang, uh, you can join us on our on our Discord. Pretty active. Just a community for fun, you know. There's nothing, nothing. Uh, that's an inconvenience, is more of just a place for all of us to chat and hang out. Talk about chips. I'll be doing stream, uh, draws too for chips and stuff. ETV today. <laughs> okay, we're probably at the edge of the world by now.
And pie. <laughs> Free pie, too. <coughs> yeah, this is definitely my favorite ship for sure. You, you, did you hear about the, uh, the Noxes that are coming out? This is like the bikes, the Nox bikes? You've probably seen those S. If you've been following it, the Nox ones. But anyway, it's... They're the same makers as this ship, the Cartual. Ah. Uh. And see if we can get the Eula from here. Oh yeah. Don't forget too guys, if you guys have any friends who like Star Citizen, make sure you mention me because we're fairly new so we've not, people, not a lot of people know about us yet. Yeah. Well that's all this is, is it's agility. It's a scout, right? It's not even really made for fighting. Pretty sick, eh? <laughs> yeah, I want one. Well, they're the same. The Nox is uh, the same makers as this ship here. It's the same uh, Zion or Zeon or whatever you call it. I don't even know how to pronounce it. I think this cost me 170. I think. I've actually only seen it on sale once. That's a fast ship too, eh? 350, is that what he's flying? The Sin, how you doing, buddy? Welcome to the channel. Thanks for joining uh, Discord Techno. Awesome. We just got to set up there last night. Actually, one of our uh, members gratefully got us all set up, and it looks pretty sweet. Big mistake, eh? Okay? Well, we'll see about that, pal. Hey, Lexi. Like, can you imagine this thing had, like, bigger guns and... Oh, imagine if it had rockets. There's no rockets. That's the downfall. That would be so sweet. Yeah, 
Yeah, dual controls would be sweet for this. They're fun dogfights with these ships, but we usually don't, usually don't end up winning. <laughs> usually end up getting creamed. We can't take we can't take very much for hits. It sucks. Great to have you here, Sin. <clears throat> we do uh, it's, we do start citizen streams a few times a day, so I mean, if you're into it, please uh, absolutely like and subscribe. We'd love to have you join. I have a Hornet too. I have one of the base Hornets, though. So <laughs> I like it. Sounds like the predator. <laughs> Actually, I was gonna ask all you viewers too. Do you guys are you guys into arena uh, arena commander? Because I can play arena commander if you guys are into that. Some people like it, some people don't. So I'll give you guys a choice. So I'll do whatever you guys want. I don't care. I'm content with whatever you guys are content with. I like the 325A. It's sweet. Watch the engines rotate. They don't quite have the tweak. They don't have it tweaked very good yet. <laughs> Are they good fighters? I've never even seen them fight. Imagine they'd be good fighters, though. <clears throat> Sorry, Arena Commander, it's kind of like, um, it's not, you're not in the Star Citizen universe, you're just in a simulator fighting, it's just like a dog fighting simulator kind of thing. You're kind of in this little zone, you can't leave the bubble, and you gotta fight waves of dudes that come out. It's not bad. It's not nearly as fun as just fighting out in the verse, like, pirates and stuff like that, but...
looks different here. <clears throat> I would say so, yeah. I think Aurora is better for exploration, I think. Actually, I have an Aurora right now because I bought a Nox, so they, and the Noxes aren't out yet, so they put uh, an Aurora in my inventory until they re release the Noxes. Arr, I be a pirate. <laughs> well, I hope you guys are enjoying the stream. I really appreciate you guys being here. Like, subscribe, check out our website, noblejoygaming.com, and we actually have our own Discord, so uh, it's down in the description. Feel free to click on that and join us. And if you're new, if you're just getting into uh, joining Star Citizen, if you want a, a little kickstart, look down in the description. I have a, a code you can input to get yourself some extra money when you uh, join. So, food for thought. Oh, it looks like we have some drama over here. Mustangs are good too. I never actually fought with one before. But a lot of people talk very well about them, so. A little squeezing here, eh? Oh, where can you rent them? I forgot about that. If we could do that on our next screen, it's, I got like 21,000 wreck. I've never spent a dime of it, so we could actually do that. Maybe a stream tomorrow. And just so you guys know too, I'm starting to solidify a schedule a little bit here. So right now, my time, it's 9.40 p.m. I'm East Coast, Canada, Atlantic Standard Time. So if you guys want to make note of that. So it's 9.40 p.m. my time. Usually I do streams, usually before 11 a.m. Sometimes I'll do one in the middle of the day, then the other one would be around the same time as tonight. So that's a rough idea of what my schedule is going to be like. It's not solidified yet, and of course it's not anchored because I got family, and family always comes first, right? Obviously. I'm sure you guys can all respect and understand that. If you guys give me ideas of what you want me to do... Uh, for my, come on, man, get out of the way, you clown! Let me know in the comments what you'd like to see on the uh, on the stream. Now I have this mental block thing. I can't work with time zones very well. I don't know. I get confused. <laughs> Of the sounds those things make. Wow. <laughs> Have you guys seen the, uh, did you guys see the uh, Drake Herald yet? It's another ship I bought. The Data Runner.
That's funny to hear that, what the lady said. They encourage us to, to ship share. Then why do they make so many sweet ships to sell? <laughs> the irony. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. They're actually fast in any direction, really, but they're just. That's all they're meant to do. Like, they can't. They have a gun, but. Should have zigged. <clears throat> there she be. These guys make it so you want to buy every ship you see, so I find that's funny. They encourage carpooling yet. Buy ships, just don't drive them. <laughs> I don't mind though. I mean, I buy the ships mainly to support these guys anyway, so. And here is the Drake Herald. Has the same look as the Caterpillar, actually. Same makers. Cool, I didn't know you could open them from that side. I opened up the satellite dishes so the ship's rocking because you're not supposed to open it while it's unless it's flying. I think. Unless I just found a new button. Oh yeah, I find this is ugly. <laughs> You want to see a fast ship? I'll show you fast. Okay, let's see if that worked. Yep, there we go. It, yeah, it has this little... It has this appeal. I think of it like a, as a wireless signal, like it's just a data runner. Like, you know, it sucked up the data with those satellite dishes, saves them on all those hard drives. So I guess you spend most of your life running around and running away from people, I guess. Delivering the news. Yeah, I know. About 850. I think there's one ship that goes faster, I think. Someone was telling me that. I'm not sure, though, but it's a fast ship.
Yeah, exactly. Hey, everything. Yeah, performance seems relatively okay. A little congested at Port Ali, but... They've actually been pretty good the last couple of days. You guys want me to land on a planet? <laughs> I can land on Jupiter if you guys want me to. Shouldn't take too too long to get there. <laughs> now you gotta think of it. You're flying in now, but you gotta think 3.0, okay? <laughs> the outcome's gonna be a lot different. Look at the clouds moving. I never noticed the clouds and the planet moving. Look, it's like a perfect snapshot of Jupiter. Yep, exactly. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Remember the first day I got this game? <laughs> yeah. First day I got this game, I was like, man, I want to land on a planet. So I just took it upon myself to land on a planet. You guys can, you can probably determine what the outcome was. Can you imagine, like, all this whole time, it, they actually implemented it, like, three weeks ago, but just no one's noticed it yet? You can land on planets. Yeah, Vishu Dragon. Actually, our stream's gonna be done here. Probably about five, ten minutes anyway. We're gonna be wrapping her up for the evening. But, um, you never know. I might be on a little later on, too. So, but like I said, I, I multiple stream a day. So, you'll hear the ding ding next time I start streaming. <laughs>
Hey, Mr. Red Green. Uh, it's apparently it's in what do you call that? Evo K T testers, evocation testers. Does that sound right? But to celebrate, we're gonna land on this planet anyway. <laughs> Not yet. Soon enough, though. Twenty fifth of August. Oh yeah. Do you play Mr. Evergreen? Yeah, 2017. You had to throw that in there too, eh? <laughs> Evo Avocado. Yes, yeah. Yo, Trans Am. What's up, pal? What are you looking for in a ship, uh, Mr. Rivergreen? No. I'd like to. Is it awesome? Are you look yeah, like Mr. Rivergreen, are you looking for like um, an exploration ship, a fighting ship, or just kind of like an all in one or small ship? Because when you get the game, it comes with a starter plane too, or a starter ship too, so you can check those out and see which ones you find work for you. Try the head SPK orbiting it. SPK, what's that? Excuse me. Oh, take your time. But uh, just to let you know, I'm Mr. Evergreen. I do a couple, like I do multiple streams a day, so I have not a ton of planes, but I have some nice ones. I have the Star for Gemini, and so if you ever want to just kind of watch and just see, see if it's for you. Actually, a lot of people just watch while they're at work, actually. But you know, absolutely subscribe and like the video and subscribe. We have lots of good chats here and discussions. If you have any questions about uh, ships or anything like that, let us know. This is the primary game I stream. I do Dark and Light, uh, Miscreated, World of Drift. I do some Rust too, but this is my primary. Probably might actually start doing World of Warcraft eventually too. Me and the wife enjoy playing that, so it'd be something for us to do. Oh, sweet deal! Right on. Appreciate the sub. We also have a website. It's uh, Noble Droid Gaming. It's still kind of in its inf infancy, but it has some information on different ships, too. Feel free to check it out. And We have forums. And we actually have a Discord channel, too. So if you ever, ever have any questions and there's no stream, uh, you can join our Discord channel, too. Friendly bunch. Don't be shy. <clears throat> Everyone's cool there. It's getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger, too. So eventually when I make it huge here... That Discord channel is going to be right there, so you might as well get in now, because it's inevitable. Yeah. I actually haven't watched Run the Verse all that much. I've seen it a few times on YouTube, actually, but... There's so much stuff in the Run of the Day I have to watch, it's, you know, it's hard. Mm-hmm, <laughs> that's right.
Oh yeah, absolutely. You know what I'm reading, guys? I just read that uh, the official trailer for It it must be Stephen King's It. It's coming out again. That's going to be sweet. I remember when it first came out. That was awesome. Um, it's been a long time since I've made this journey. I don't know. Not much longer. <laughs> yeah. Long story short, yeah. I'll think I'll crash into it like in another... Three minutes, I think. Maybe longer. There's no point. I mean, we don't have to do this either. We can actually just try a different ship before the stream ends anyway. <laughs> I don't remember being at this long last time. Well, I'm ashamed. What am I going to do? Zoink. There it goes. I wonder how quiet it is out here. What's that movie called where they get stuck in space? Yeah, they did. It looks, uh, it looks awesome. I can't wait. I think this will be very sweet when it comes out. But that being said, guys, that is going to conclude the Star Citizen Noble Droid Gaming streaming for this evening. For now, anyway. I might, uh, you never know with me, I might decide to throw another one later on in a few hours. But um, thanks a lot for viewing the stream, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe. Tell your friends. We're growing. We're starting, but we're building a momentum. And we all definitely want to be a part of it. So help us get there, guys. I appreciate it. So uh, thanks again for watching the stream, guys. And we will see you tomorrow. So uh, enjoy your evening. And Noble Droid out. Peace. Yeah, I noticed that too, actually, Toby. <laughs> they fix it in Star Marine, though. When you're shooting out in Star Marine, you just hear like a little tuck, tuck, tuck. Like it's almost like it's just pressure, so. But yeah, I agree with you. <laughs> Alright, guys. Have a good one, man.